Hey everyone, and welcome back. It's been a quite a while since I last did a Pokemon TCG box opening, and I figure why not give it a shot with Marshadow? I mean, it's been almost a year, and this pack has everything I like in it. Packs and a cute little figurine. I'm going to cut the video and we'll begin, we'll be right back with the pack opening of themselves. And we're back and it's time to open some cards. But first, I'm impressed. It came with a little advertisement in the thing. You see this plush doll right here? I've been looking all over the world for it. They don't sell it anywhere. Uh, but like with all my TCG box openings, I always look at first the thing it comes with. And this Marsh Shadow is not only adorable, it's highly detailed and very blurry. Come on, focus. Focus. Eh, it doesn't want to focus. But no, it's really highly detailed, really heavy plastic, but I have one problem with it. It's very top heavy. It's the slightest knock into something will send it toppling over. Make sure you can bend it over a little bit. But, like all also TCG boxes, these come with a cute little card. I don't know if it's that good. I don't play TCG that often. Or at all. A little blurry, that's one thing I can tell. I mean, it's a really pretty card. Our shadow's always adorable, though it's missing its green fire in his hair. Uh, I guess that shadow punch is good. It does 30 damage for only 2 power. And it uh, isn't affected by weakness. So I guess that's good. Try not to get the blur, the glare. But this is the code card, online code card. I'll give you all these at the end of the, actually no, I'll give them to you now. Because I have no use for them. So there's your code. Make use of it if you will. Make use of it if you don't. I don't care. And it's good. And we're going to start, okay, yeah, okay, every other. Ancient Origins. If I remember correctly, you get shiny legendaries in this pack. Okay, if I remember correctly how to do this, it's code card. One, two, three, one, two, so you put the rest right there. And we start off with the cute little hyper-realism Beldum. Looks like it's one of those clay pictures they use, which I love. Oddish. My favorite Pokemon, one of my favorite Pokemon, MK. One of my big time favorite Pokemon go work. Porygon. Curlia, which evolves into my favorite Pokemon of all time. Ampharos Spirit Link, useless because I don't have Ampharos. A Lucky Helmet. Oh cool, Full Art Card Gyarados. And this is the rare in the pack, which means we got a special holographic right here. I think, I hope. Unless we got screwed over, and this is supposed, supposed to be the hot. Yeah, whoa, that's Entei. So this was supposed to be holographic. That sucks. But since that's a legendary, it gets put back here. And since this was supposed to be holographic, I'll put that back here. That's cool, though. That's Entei. That's awesome. Entei is my favorite amongst the Beast Trio. Now we will go to... Crimson Invasion. I believe you can get the uh, Ultra Beast out of these packs. That'd be cool if I got one. It's been a while since I opened Pokemon cards. Pack card for you. First come, first serve. I hope you're a lucky person. One, two, three. One, two. And we begin this with a Shelmet. Shelmet. Goes to Swablu. Swablu goes to a Swain. Nope. Oh, that's actually a really cute art. I like that one. One of my favorite Pokemon, Jigglypuff. One of my mains in Smash Bros, anyways. Houndour. Reverse Hollow Minchino. Hakamo. -o. I love the Dragon cards. Hello, Lusamine. Why can't I get a full art of you? Sweet baby Jesus. Pile of swine. Xerneas. Wow, it's a holographic. I don't think I have a Xerneas card. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, 
and a steel energy. And uh, loosen me, but come on back. Oh, but yeah, Xerneas goes over here since it's a holographic. That's two technically two holographics in one pack from one box so far. Next, we return to a Steam Siege. There is a certain card I would love to get out of here. The, the possibility of getting it are astronomical. But this is the pack that has Shiny Guard of Mega Gardevoir in it. I get that, and you might hear me scream like a little girl. Code card for you all. One, two, three, one, two. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm not at Xerneas is a nice surprise. Start with a nice clauncher. Cute little fletchling. Seed up. Steel Soul and Drifloom. I saw a shiny Pokemon. Meryl. Rapidash. Uh, whatever that means. That's really cool looking. That's a shiny Azumarill. Infernape, the rare. Hoopa! So I got screwed out of another... This is meant to be holographic then. Well, that sucks because they're both rare. So I got screwed out of, twice out of uh, holographics. But I got Demon Form Hoopa, which is awesome. It's actually a pretty good attack. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that one. Like Entei, he goes over here. Uh, this is a pretty good haul so far. And those are some pretty good cards. The last pack is another Crimson Invasion. I got the Xerneas out of the first, last Crimson Invasion. And I got him in a holographic out of every pack so far. That's wild. Code card. One, two, three. One, two. Why isn't Hoopa holographic? That's my question. Starly. A new mo. Chang Chang Mexico. A Bunnelsby. A Carablast to go with the other one we got. Wigglytuff. That is the rare in the pack. Did I get screwed over yet again? I'll hold this back here. Meme tank. Meme, meme, meme. The Sea of Nothingness. Ooh, that's Ultra Space. Oh, that's cool. That's a cool name. Gastrodon. And, oh, we got a holographic out of every single pack. Would you believe that? Well, a rare that was meant to be holographic. Like the, the Gyarados and the Infernape were meant to be holographics. Because we both got rares in their packs. And then we got a holographic go go. Why the hell is go go holographic? That's my question. Why the hell is a go go holographic? Put me down there. But that's a hell of a good. That's a holographic rare, or at least supposed to be holographic rare, out of every single pack. And two legendary, three legendaries, if you count Xerneas, for two non hollow legendaries. That's wild. That must be one of the best pulls I've ever gotten. But I hope you get use out of those code cards. I know I won't. And I hope you enjoyed this little video. I don't know why people enjoy watching these so much, but hell, I'll do them. They'll get, they get views and you guys love them, so I make them. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and share it around. If you got use out of those code cards, let me know in the comments below. I will really warm my heart knowing this will help get people what they like. Uh, follow me on Twitter and subscribe to my channel to get a little insight into the mind of madness and to know when all my videos go live. And with all that said, this has been Black Phoenix. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all next time.